John Dillinger, 25 years ago today, America's most notorious desperado, held in a supposedly escape-proof jail presided over by a woman sheriff at Crown Point, Indiana, the cocky bad man bluffed his way out with a wooden gun. Posse's hunted him for months following this most spectacular incident in a career of robberies, jailbreaks, and killings that terrorized the Midwest. In March, Dillinger had escaped, despite scores of heavily armed guards and he eluded a nationwide manhunt for months until one summer night in Chicago, the FBI closed in as public enemy number one was leaving a North Side theater.
John Dillinger, 25 years ago today, America's most notorious desperado, held in a supposedly escape-proof jail presided over by a woman sheriff at Crown Point, Indiana, the cocky bad man bluffed his way out with a wooden gun. Posse's hunted him for months following this most spectacular incident in a career of robberies, jailbreaks, and killings that terrorized the Midwest.